Hi, Kipsters. Today we're going to learn how to find the given mean, um, how to find the missing number when we're given the mean in a data set. You've seen these types of questions before. If you see three numbers and you don't know what the fourth one is, but you know the mean is 22, here's how we're going to go about solving it. Well, first we've got to think about what does the mean actually mean? Well, the mean is the typical value in a data set that's found when we add up all the numbers and divide by the number of add-ins. In this case, I have one, two, three, four add-ins, and if I divide this sum by four and I get 22, then the inverse of um, dividing a number by four to get 22 would be to multiply 22 times four. So that's the first step if you do not want to solve this algebraically. So you get 88 as your answer. Now what you want to do after you get your product of 88, so that's what you know all of these numbers should add up to, you're going to add up all the numbers that you have so far. So I have 32 plus 17 plus 26. And that's going to give me 2 plus 7 is 9, 9 plus 5, 9 plus 6 is 15, 1 plus 3 is 4, 4 plus 1 is 5, and 5 plus 2 is 7, so I have 75. So I need to know what this missing number is, and to do that, I'm going to subtract my sum from my product, 88 minus 75, and I get 13. The missing number is 13. Okay, now if you wanted to solve this problem algebraically, what you would do is you would do 32 plus 17 plus 26 plus x. To find the mean, we're going to add up all these numbers and divide by 4 equals 22. So the first step would be to multiply both um, sides by the reciprocal because I want to get divided by 4 away from this. So I would multiply by 4, and these would grow cross cancel, and I get 1 and 1. And what you do to one side, I do to the other. So I do 22 times 4, and that's 88. Now I have 32 plus 17. I want to combine these numbers together. 32 plus 17 is 30, 49. 49 plus 26 is 49 plus 26 is 75. So 75 plus x, I still don't know what that number is, equals 88. I'm going to subtract the 75 from both sides and I get x equals 13. So there are two different ways that you can solve this. You can solve it by taking the mean, multiplying it by the number of add-ins you have, and then getting a product, and then adding up the numbers that you do have and subtracting that sum from the product to find your missing number. Or you can literally write out what the steps to find the mean are. Add up all of the numbers and divide by the number of add-ins. Add up all of the numbers, 32 plus 17 plus 26 plus x, a number that I don't know yet, all divided by 4 equals 22. Now if you're dividing by 4, the inverse of dividing by 4 is multiplying by 4. So I'm going to multiply both sides by 4. And when I do that to this side, I can pull out a common factor of 4. So 4 divided by 4 is 1, and 4 divided by 4 is 1. And 1 times anything gives you the same exact um, number as the identity property of multiplication. So 32 plus 17 plus 26 plus x equals... 88 now, okay? When you combine all of these numbers together, you get 75 plus x. Now this looks like a regular equation in which we're going to find the answer by using the inverse operation. So I'm going to subtract 75 from both sides. And when I do that, I get x on this side by itself, which is what I want, equals 13.